he can't take lands. And and land is the next thing I'm playing. Okay, so we decided to brainstorm. So unless he has the Caracas. Now if I wanted to protect my uh, pithy needle from, we're gonna click Emrakul here. If we wanted to protect the pithy needle from what he's about to do, I need to take the Vendillion click. Um, God, it's auto tapping for me. It bothers me. If I want to, if I want to, you know, play around Crocus, I have to take the the Vendillion click because the Vendillion click could upkeep take the pithing needle. Um, so I like just naming Vendillion click here. He did keep it in hand. Uh, what's nice is Containment Priest doesn't stop this. I'm actually play is synonymous with cast, so we're not worried about the Containment Priest. Um, so we're taking the Vendillion Clique, which is the most uh, threatening thing, I think, if, if I'm worried about a Caracas. Saver Power for Needle was draw top with Needle underneath. Poor Containment Priest. I called it, though. There's the Containment Priest. Now, he's going to try it, though. And unless Moto's busted, I mean, in paper, this works just fine. Um... You know, unless Magic Online is is broken. Well, he didn't play the Caracas, so I don't need to play the Needle. Anyway. It does count as casting. Which is important, because if it didn't, Containment Priest would work. Everyone's poor. <laughs> True. He's still going to try it. It's fine. We, we know how this works, unless Magic Online is busted, which thankfully it's not. Uh, and this does count as casting, so I do get the extra turn, which is kind of neat. What did we say his hand was? Uh... Like a Snapcaster? I don't even know if he'd keep that there. Brainstorm, Snap, Snare. Okay. Alright, get in there, Emmy! So, Hallowed Moonlight will work when Priest doesn't. <laughs> Doomsday is fun. Now, to, to make us not lose to Top Deck Caracas, I am going to cast the Needle and name Caracas. That is an out for my opponent. Because the Emrakul wasn't lethal, he's at 5. So I, I like I like just make making it sure that there's no chance. I'm gonna name Caracas. This puts him on zero outs. I'm officially in love with this deck. Red Blast is not good against Tin Fins. Don't bring it in. Don't do it. Just don't do it to yourself. This card, just letting you all know, if you're Miracles players and you want to try to beat Tin Fins, don't bring this card in. It's not good. It's just not good in the matchup. You're better off with, like, this. Or Spell Pierce, or anything else. Did I cast any blue spells this game? No. Just putting that out there. Doom fins equals doom wins. All right, game one is ours. And that's what I like to do to them Miracles players. Yeah. We did it. We did it. Perfect victory. Good. Thank God you're streaming. What's up, Griffin? I'm in a good mood tonight, guys. Uh, regardless of winning that game, I was in a good mood before. Sing the Doom song now. What is the Doom song? Yeah, the only cards that are blue are cantrips. I guess you could, like, Red Elemental Blast a Chain of Vapor, but I didn't even bring this in, did I? It's the only good stream on. Aw, thanks, Griffin. I appreciate it. This burrito is delicious, by the way. 
It's a barbecue brisket burrito. Oh, this isn't Asian food, this is Mexican. But I do like Asian food. I like sushi. If it was Asian food, I'd be eating it with uh, chopsticks. What is this? Is this the Doom song? Hang on. The heads of our doomed enemies. I gotta sing the Doom song now. <laughs> this is the Doomsday song. This is Invader Zim, right? Yeah. Seafood. I mean, I, 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 I do like seafood. So you want me to sing this? Doom to doom, doom to doom. Doom to doom, doom, doom to doom. Back to Kishia Kyoin and the Akubosi Rockets. I happen to like this song. It's not my favorite song by them, though. Food, please. Of course, you're happy you danced twice. I really appreciate the donations, guys, and anytime you do it, I'll read what you write, and I'll do a silly dance for you. Ethan Magic Brown, it's that's not the current deck list, I apologize. Let me update this. Let's make a new command. There we go. Check it out. Uh, at command, um... Hang on, it's not happy with me. Never understand people's love of Stoneforge. It's a great card. I've played my fair share of Stoneblade. Well, Stasis seems to have evolved. That's the old Timfins list right here. Deck list. This one? Deck list. Tinfins. That was Tinfins New Hotness, which was Burning Wish. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. At command. There we go. Dooby dooby doo. Dooby doo doo. Dooby dooby doo. Deck list, um. Doom Bob Fins. Alright, try typing that. <laughs> Good luck. Just kidding, that's not my. That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to troll you guys. Robopod! You guys want to see Robopod? Such Robopod. Seems to be like everybody's favorite emote on this channel is the Robopod one that Jack made. He did a really good, really good job with it. This is a little too quiet. Let's turn it up. Let's turn it up. Got some great music coming up, guys. Don't go away. Yes, we did take that game really quick. And you want to know something? That's how you beat Miracles. You just be so fast. That's how you beat other Storm decks, too, or other combo. You just be so fast. Tin Fins is one of the fastest decks you can be playing in Legacy outside of, like, Belcher or um, Oops All Spells. We're fastest, fastest gun in the West. So, it, it, it's a huge advantage. What's up, Nate? We're just faster. We're just, we're just faster. I'm not saying we're more resilient. We're not. We're not more resilient. Uh, really well-placed Spell Pierce or well-placed Force of Will, and we have to go back to Draw Go. I'm just saying we're fast. We're really fast. And we fought through Spell Pierce twice. That, those games. 
We had we made enough mana that it didn't matter. Yeah, Oops is a fine deck, Stein. I'm not saying that this is necessarily better than Oops. I just prefer this to Oops or Belcher. I, I, I enjoy this deck much, much more. Those are fine fast decks. You know. Huh. Why don't you just add a sideboard plan that doesn't involve the graveyard? That's what we've done here. Switch over to Doom Bob. Doom Bob. Doom Bob. Doom Bob. When the bag just goes away. Doom Bob. Doom Bob. Man, we might have enough time in between rounds to play a whole game of this deck. Jeez. Mark's still playing. There's two matches still going. The sideboard plan requires lands. What's my grindy deck of choice? Shardless? No, my grindy deck of choice is Robopod. My grindy deck of choice is Robopod. Because we can Emrakul fairly. There's really nothing fair about the Doomsday Sheldock pile. I've killed plenty of Miracles players with it, though. Even through Caracas, I've, I've killed them. Sent them to their doom. I thought he was playing uh, the Steven Schleppers list. Captain, I thought I thought Mark was playing Stephen Schlepper's uh, Reliquary Knight. Well, Brave Sir Robin, but to to the not to the uninitiated Nightfall, but to me it's it's Brave Sir Robin. The decks do actually share a card or two, right? They both have Grizzlebrand. <laughs> Come on. Nobody brought Graveyard Hate till you started playing. <laughs> That's funny. A local metagame is fun. So we've actually built this without blue as well. Check this out. Well, Mind Break doesn't count. Um, so this is Fearless Robopod. This is the new hotness. This is the new thing that we're doing here. Um, I don't know if it's better. In some ways it's worse. In some ways it's better. The mana is much, much less volatile. It's, it's much smoother. Yes, that's actual CDC. Is she staying? Maybe. I'm not sure. It's got the same finishers for the most part. Well, I'm not even sure if Grizzlebrand is, is the best finisher anymore. Since we don't have Force of Will, Snaff was talking to me about it, for example. We were talking about it, and um, we're not sure this is the best finisher for a non blue Robopod because I can't draw into Forces. He's doing Rhino Nick Fit. Oh, that's cool. What happened to Stasis? Super Gravity. It never left. Let me link this though. This is this is for all you budget fans out there. Well, it's it's more budget than the last one. If you want to try this, this is a blast. You pod straight into Platinum Empyreans and Grizzlebrands and nas post board nasty terasties. I am. Uh, it's right here. Yeah, there's a Singleton Volras Stronghold. It works well with Frag Tusk too, which is nice. Which is nice. All right. Um, somebody said they want to see Stasis. Chalice and Chains 4.4 is where I left off with Stasis. It's an intuition planeswalker control with Tesserator undertones. It's also got Helm combo in the board. Main deck, the combo besides Stasis Lock is Soar the Meek Thopter Foundry. A lot of forces, man. I'm not sure I want that many. Looks something like this. The combos that I can assemble for the stasis aren't just the planeswalkers. Ral plus stasis is a lock. Tezzer at the Seeker plus stasis plus an artifact like Mox Diamond or Seed of the Cyanide is a lock. But also, stasis plus Tabernacle is a board sweeper, potentially. 
if you if you time it right, 